Hey guys, what's up? We're back here with the latest episode of the Skodrick Manson My Player Season. This is episode number 59. I'm in this episode. We're going to be playing up against Genk in the last group game of the Europa League. Then we're going to be playing against Liverpool, where we're going to be playing in the Premier League away at Anfield. As you can see on our table for the Europa League so far this season, five played, 13 points. We've dropped two points from one of the games where we got a draw instead of a win. The rest of the games we've won. And as you can see from the goal scoring list here, we're not doing too great for goals, but Hazard was in there. And as for assists, Manson is currently sitting top with seven. So I'm leading the leaderboard with the assists, but the goals have been spread out throughout the players of the team. As you can see, we're currently sat second in the squad ranking. And we're just leaving here on our flight from London. And we're going to head off to Belgium where we're going to be playing in Genk against Genk. As you can see there as well, we're doing really well in this uh, Europa League season so far. We're still in all competitions at the moment as it stands and we're already uh, we're already definitely into the knockouts after this game, no matter what the result is from this. But we're going to hope we can get a win, get another three points to go 16 points at the top of the table and finish this group stage. As you can see there, such a good goal difference, such a good points, tally, wins, draw and no losses at all this season in the Europa League. So we're going to hope that we can push on and get the victory here just to finish off this group stage, have a really good positive um, impact and towards going in. And as you can see here, Hazard, Costa, Manson at the top, Pasolic, Mikel, Baker, along with Kane, Luis, Omero and Bab at the back with Couture in goal. This is going to be a good game, guys. We've already beaten Genk once this season. We've beaten all the other teams except for, I think we drew against Rosenberg one time and that was about it so we're going to hopefully beat them again here and do another game another three points and then we're going to be heading off against Liverpool later on in this episode so here we are now with the kickoff against Genk away from home in Belgium this is going to be a good game here we come with a chance and now working our way up the pitch nicely a free kick here from Kane putting it in the box here pass to the uh, Diego Costa's head there good save and that goes out of play for a corner kick. Here we come now. Fourth minute played. The corner kick comes in. Can the ball get to anyone's head here? Going into the box. Now Pasolic with the header. And he's got right in the top corner. Five minutes corner. We've already taken the lead here. Pasolic with the header. Manston had nothing to do with this one. Just sat and admired the beauty of that goal. That cross from the corner. Header right into the top corner. Above the goalkeeper's hands. Above the defender's head who was on the line. Look at that. Perfect placement from that header from Pasolic. And it goes right in the top corner to make it 1-0 here. Already in the fifth minute against Genk. What a goal that was as well. And happy days for this team. For Chelsea. For a goal straight away. Nice and early. Pasolic with that goal. Here we are now though. Heading away with a kickoff to Genk. Where they're going to try. And Chelsea going to try and come up with a chance here. Manson making a run through here. Manson's clean through to make it 2-0. Manson having a shot there. Just saved by the goalkeeper. Then great save from him. And it goes out for a corner kick. Here we come on another attack now. Laying it off to Manson. Coming up with a good run up the right wings. Manson can we get this into the box now. Having a shot here. Last minute shot there. Hits the side and ending. Get taken out as well. But nothing given. Goes out for a goal kick. 26 minutes gone. Here come Genk on the attack now. Good chance here. Can they lay it central? Yes they can. Having a shot there. Just goes wide of the post. And no one can quite get on the score sheet for Genk today at the moment. Here comes Manson getting a tackle in against the last defender. Now making his way forward with the ball to feet. Trying to turn that last defender. Laying it off there. Trying to get it to the feet of Diego Costa. And can't quite get it into the box. Here comes Manson once again. Twisting and turning on the ball. Making our way forward. Just into the box. Now having a shot there. Just goes over the crossbar by inches. And it goes out for a goal kick. 41 minutes now. Genk on the attack. Can they get the ball in the box? Here they come with a shot. Good effort there from Genk and it doesn't quite make it on target and it goes out of play. Here comes Manston now making his way forward up the right wing, twisting and turning once again, trying to get past the defender. Great piece of skill then having a shot. It just just left foot dragged wide of the right side of the goal. Should have been 2-0 then but it wasn't quite enough. Here comes Genk with a chance, cross into the back post and misses everybody. Gets cleared out of play here by the Chelsea players and there goes the halftime whistle here guys. Currently 1-0 up here. Pasolic's goal from that header from the corner to make it 1-0 here. And we're doing really, really well so far. Look at that. One shot, one goal. We've had a, an abundance of chances. Unlucky we haven't scored more. But we're going to try and get some more goals in the second half. Just to seal this victory and get all three points today. Here comes Manston on the ball now. Making his way in the box. Coming in from the right wing. Can we get a chance here? Trying to do a bit too much skill on the ball. And we've been taken out by the defender and won it back then here comes Manson making his way up the right wing with an overhead through ball to his feet can he get on the end of it here yes he can can we work it into the box with that cross yes we can but it's just been saved by the goalkeeper here we come on another attack Manson laying it off there to Pasolic Pasolic can't quite get on the end but he volleys it anyway Pasolic has gone and made it 2-0 that's two shots two goals for him he's gone and scored once again in this game what a volley that was what a game he's having so far 
it was not the best of three balls from Manston and I don't think that will count as an assist as the defender chested it down as you can see there but he took advantage of that chest down he volleyed it first time and he smashes it straight at the goalkeeper who cannot save that power and accuracy to go into the top side of the net and it's gone and made it 2-0 here Chelsea against Genk and we've gone and pretty much sealed the three points here today. Genk not really having many chances. Pasic coming out there with his second goal in the Euro League, his second goal of the day and second goal here for Chelsea today. Look at that, six minutes, 73rd minute and we're going to head off into the last couple of minutes of this game. Hopefully going to add to the score sheet in the 76th minute. We haven't done too much else in this game, Manson, but he's making his way forward now, cutting around these defenders, using his extreme pace to get forward here. This is a great chance for Manson to make this 3-0 here, having a shot. It gets blocked, it comes back down. Can Manson get it back to feet? Yes, he can and it's done. In. That took a bit of time there from the first shot hitting the post, but we got the rebound coming back into the box, laid it off to Manson. Manson goes and finishes it in the bottom corner. 78 minutes played, it's 3 0 here. Manson with a goal, and he goes and scores his one of his many goals in the Europa League. This is a great run from Manson, having a shot there, saved by the goalkeeper. Hazard laying it back into Manson, who first time half volleys it on his left foot into the back of the net and it goes right on the bottom corner keeper cannot save that one and that's a great goal from Manston hopefully hopefully we're going to do well in this Euro League this has been such a good game so far such a good campaign in the Europa League that's my second goal and my seventh assist I've got seven assists in the league at the um, moment so we're doing so well getting on this all the all the tables and the sheets of what we need to do. And let's just try and get one more goal here. Can we do anything now? Great chance, Manson, an abundance of space here. Can we do anything with it now? We've got our Salsa Central. Our Salsa just can't quite get on the end of that pass. But Genk run away with the ball. Here comes Manson with another layoff over the top to his feet here, laying it into our Salsa. Our Salsa making a run. Manson cutting inside here, opening up the space. Manson would to make it 4 0. Manson having a shot. He goes and puts it in. It's made it 4 0 here in the 90th minute. Manson goes and scores once again on his left foot, hits it into the right side of the net. Really confused the keeper with that shot. That was a great little piece of play there from our Salsa to Manson. And he goes and shoots it in the opposite side of the net. Least expected for the goalkeeper to see it, the near post. And the keeper was unaware of that completely and it goes right into the side of the net there great goal from Manson that's his now third goal in the Europa League an assist there from Al Salsa fourth goal of the game today and we've gone Manson scored two uh, Pasolic has scored two and this has just turned out to be a phenomenal game it's 4-0 here 90th minute that looks like it's going to be all for today by the looks of it though there it goes there's the full time whistle and what a game that was we've just finished the group stages of the Europa League in great style We've gone and got a 4-0 win again here. And we're going to head out of this game. Top of the table with 16 points and getting ready for our, for our knockout round of 32, I believe, coming up very soon. But as for this game's finished, a couple days later, we're going to head out of there. We're going to be driving around in London. We're just going to head off to the bank to sort out a few financial situations we're having. As you can see from these stats, we are still doing really well in all competitions. 12 goals, 13 assists. And we're just going to be heading into the bank now. And we've just got a few things to sort out. We're going to open a few accounts because we're getting quite a lot of money in at the moment. And we just want to make sure it's all in the right place. We're earning as much interest as possible. You can see we've got Liverpool coming up later on in this episode. And then after that, the episode will finish. And we've got a few more games coming up before Christmas in this season so far. We're just here at the bank waiting in line to sort our stuff out. And then... I kind of looked over to my right and I suddenly saw if you see him in the back there by the flag the same guy that was watching us who's been spying on us and watching us in a few episodes ago in a couple episodes and we suddenly realized something terrible has happened guys look at this some armed men have entered the bank they're coming in there's four of them all with duffel bags they're here to rob the bank and this is not looking good they're just about to come in they've They've cable tied the door shut. They're about to put on their mask and this is not looking good. Manson is inside along with several other people and they all have armed with silenced guns. Here they come now. They've got us all with our hands up in the air. This isn't good. They're stealing all the money from the vault. They're trying to get everything out and they are just, everyone is scared for their lives here at the moment. This is not good. And as you notice, the guy in the corner, can you see him? He is still there. He is part of this group. What is happening with his four armed men and he was here Nobody obviously knows. doing some recon and just uh, just then the police turn up the alarms go off and they haven't harmed anyone as of yet but they got their money and they're making their way out of here and they're going to try and get away past the police and now the police all lining up outside to try and keep them down but they're not going down without a fight these guys they're going to go for it and they went and believe it or not guys they actually went and got away they escaped from the police they had a getaway vehicle ready they got away 
We luckily got out unharmed. They didn't really want to hurt anyone by the looks of it, but they they left us. They left everyone else in the back, but they took all the money and they got away. That was one of the scariest moments of my life. I thought I was about to die, but here we go, guys. Let's just try our hardest to forget about that for now, but still worrying about that guy. We're second in the league table, so we're one point off. We need a win in this Liverpool game, but I can't get that my head out of the... I can't get that guy out of my head. He was in the corner. He was there when we got there. He was part of the group and he escaped with them. Who is that guy? Who is he? He's been watching us as well, which is very worrying. Him being at the bank at the same time as us. You guys, what is going on? You need to tell me because I have no idea. I wonder what it could be. I wonder what his involvement is with all of this. They just robbed the bank. They've been following me around. They've been watching me for a good few months now and I'm getting really quite worried. They beat me up. I think it was them that beat me up, part of their group. They have my cars burnt out. If it's the same people, it all adds up. I'm not sure what it is, but something, something weird is happening around London at the moment and we need to figure out what is going on. This is just too much to handle. But for now, we're going to try our hardest to focus on this upcoming game we've got against Liverpool away at Anfield. It's a snowy day up in the north of England. It's not snowing too much down in London, but in Chelsea, but up here in the north of England, in Liverpool, it is. It's coming up to Christmas and it's snowing up here. So it's going to be a very, makes for a very, very interesting game. And the usual lineups, Costa not starting now, our Salsa starting instead of him. And as you can see, player to watch there is me, Manston, two goals in the last game. To be honest, Pasolic should really be a player to watch as well. Two goals in the last game for him as well. But we got on that sheet and there we are waiting for our chance to go on and get a better result. Another result here in the league. Get another three points on the table. And here we are kicking off Liverpool with the ball at Anfield. Can they go on and get three points or can we get another three points and go top of the table for us? A couple minutes played now. Liverpool on the attack. Sturridge on the ball. Can he work this in nicely to Mason? Mason on the ball now laying it into Sahin. Sahin trying to get the ball forward. Can he lay it? Or it goes to... Sahin again a weak shot there but nothing quite major and here we come on the ball now Manston making his way forward getting the ball back to feet from Dada putting a ball in the box here chest down from the Liverpool defender and it's gone in what an own goal cross from Manston only a couple minutes played in this game Manston goes and crosses the ball in after a free ball from Dada there goes straight to the opposition player's chest and he can't do anything about that one and it's gone in the captain of Liverpool there I think it was Dejan Louvran and he's gone and chested it in. It was aimed for Al Salsa. It went to the defender there. See, Lovran goes and chested in for an own goal here, guys. And luckily for Manston, we've gone and put that cross in, which has led to that goal. So that's really positive so far in this game. Can we push on and get another goal here? 17 minutes played. Manston making his way forward, trying to get the ball back. Al Salsa wins it back to Manston. Manston with a great opportunity to shoot here. Good save from Mignolet to keep that one out. And it has gone out for a corner kick there. Nothing coming of it, though. In the end, now Salsa trying to get the ball down to his head here. Liverpool getting the ball back, laying it off to Sturridge. Sturridge up there, right wing. Can they do anything with it here? But no. Lovran, the own goal scorer, got injured, and he is now out and been subbed off. Here we come now. Chelsea getting the ball down. Liverpool trying to have a shot there away from it. And here comes Al Salsa with a great through ball for Manson, making our way forward up the pitch. Now, can we work this into the box here? Can Al Salsa? No, he can't. He's just been tackled there by the Liverpool defender. And it goes out of play here. Coming up to half time now. Ryan Mason on the ball at the edge of the box, having a shot there. Good save from Kotoa to keep them out. And we're going to head in for a corner just before half time. Can they get a chance here? Chesting it down is Jassan trying to lay it off, but the Chelsea players win it back. Lay up to Manston, and there goes the half time whistle here today. 1-0 up because of the own goal from Lovran, who then got injured and substituted off from the cross from Godric Manston there. So he's playing pretty well. I'm playing pretty well at the moment. And we're just looking. We've got the 1-0 lead. We're looking to keep this throughout this game. Try not to concede and then get the three points. Can we push on and get another goal at the moment? It's a bit 50-50 at the moment, though. Second half just starting. Here's Markovic to Mason in the box here. And just punched it over there was... Uh, Couture, and here we come on another attack now Manston making his way forward into the box can we work this in great chance for Manston to hold it up nicely bit of a roulette then but can't quite do anything with it goes out for a corner kick here we come now 70 minutes played Manson making his way in the box now great opportunity cut inside here great little piece of touching can Manson have a shot here he can but it's just been saved by Mignolet who's put it out for a corner kick 70th minute and here comes the corner now but to feet of Manson Manson trying to work his way in the box there getting tackled but the ball comes straight back to his feet here can Hazard lay to Manson yes he can Manson lays it in to Oscar Oscar back to Manson with the shot it's just hit the 
post then from that great finesse shot from Manston and it goes out and continues play here. Manston making his way up the right wing of the ball, getting the ball in the box now but nothing can quite come of it and it looks like it's going to go out. Here we come on an attack just tackling the defender in now. It's constant Chelsea attacks here with a great chance for Dada. Dada again denied. Mignolet is on really good form so far in this game. Hasn't conceded except for that own goal but at the moment it's the 90th minute and that goal own goal is the only thing that has given us the lead so far. Manson making his way forward. If we can hold on for a couple more minutes we've won this game. Manson with a throw and up on the right wing laying it back to Van Ginkel to Manson. Manson making his way in the box now. Can we get it round the defender? Yes we can. Great chance. Just laid it too short for Van Ginkel and it's being played out of play here. There goes guys the full time whistle. We've got a 1-0 victory here from the own goal. It was only 1-0 but it got the three points that we needed to advance further up on the table in this game. Another win for Chelsea in December here in the snow. About to head back down to London where we're going to be getting off the bus and going home and spending a night back in London before the next episode. So that was a really good game. We just managed to win it. But as you can see here, we're still currently not enough points on the table. 32 points now, one point behind Manchester United. So we're doing well, but just not well enough at the moment. But we're very close. We've got Manchester City coming up in the next episode, which is going to be a big, big game on the 21st of December. Then after Christmas on the 28th, we've got West Ham. Who we're going to be playing as well in the Premier League. So two Premier League fixtures coming up and then we're going to be heading off into January. And then as you can see here, we're doing really well in the league so far. EFL, four goals, three assists in the Euro League, um, three goals, seven assists. And we're just doing so well overall this season. It's been a fantastic season at the moment. Lots of drama, lots of things going on. We're second in the squad rankings overall, just behind Courtois and in front of Hazard. And that's it really for this episode, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed this one. Quite a bit of a shock in the middle there with that robbery being involved right in the middle of it. But we're going to just worry about the games for now, focus on the Premier League. We'll try and figure out who this guy is that we keep seeing everywhere at another time. But for now, we'll head out of this episode and I'll see you guys in the next one. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please like, share and subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.